Wow, did you guys see the Orcane announcement at EVO? That was really cool. I definitely saw that. Orcane with grabs and throws is so weird to see. And that air dash too? Very interesting choice. Definitely extends his combo game in. Hold on. Yeah, I'm sorry everyone. I saw the leaks. I saw the Hatsune Miku crossover skin in the files. I just made this video early because I really need views. I need to become the biggest rivals YouTuber so I can get a crossover skin in the game once I reach 100,000 subscribers. But I still want to provide some good content for all of you. So I brought on my friend Bucket, the highest placing and only Orcane player in the last Rivals of Ether Top 50 to give you some tips and tricks on Orcane to give you a head start on him in this upcoming beta weekend. Alright, alright. What what should we learn first? Okay, so first, uh, how do you run as this character? All right, so how you run as this character is you plug in your keyboard and you click either D or A, and that is how you run with this character. You have throw away controller and then plug in your keyboard and then click either A or D, and that is how you run with this character. Uh huh. The next thing I want to know is uh. How do you recover on this character? Alright, so the most basic option ever is you put down a puddle, unless you're getting hit off stage. Boom. Look at that. You can oh. teleport to a puddle. Oh! Wait, yeah. hold on. You can... Oh my yeah, gosh. Look at that. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. So the only time you want to ever puddle is when it's on like the other side of the stage, because then if they're like edge guarding you here or whatever, they won't be able to get back in time. Let's say you don't have a puddle on stage, all right? You just want to side beat a wall, and then that sets up like literally everything. Kind of mix up with fair. You can stall in the air, you can go fast, you can go slow. It's just, it's a great option, all right? So yeah, uh, are you planning on playing Orkane this next beta? Yeah, I'm thinking of trying out Orkane, even though floor hugging feels bad. Although last patch was a step in our direction, recovery system is a lot shallower. Movement feels very clunky and is a direct downgrade from one. All the souls taken out of the combo game with the removal of Drifty Eye and the engine changes. All the returning characters feel like a gutted version of their former selves. Game looks like absolute dog shit. Pummel system fucking sucks. And Orkane is like so ugly. Why the fuck did they give him like yellow eyes, bro? I don't care if it's like lore accurate, bro. He looks so stupid. He looks, he looks high, bro. Why the fuck would you make him like- Wow. Did you guys see the Hodon announcement at EVO? That was really cool. I definitely saw that. I saw it coming though, because Super Rare Boy, the artist that worked on Hodon in Rivals Workshop, was involved in the Rivals 2 Character Contest winner video, drawing all the art of the characters. This tipped off an elite group of Rivals of Ether lore hunters to go onto Hodon stage and find a way to unlock him, finally getting him by updrawing 2,401 times underneath the side platform. Everyone that thought it was Orkane is dumb, because Orkane actually originated from Slingshell in the Atari. And after the $10 million lawsuit against Ether Studios for including him in Rivals, forcing them to host a Kickstarter for Rivals 2 to try and recoup their losses, I doubt they'd try and add him again. Okay, actually, I have a confession to make. I didn't see the announcement. I'm just trying to game the system by getting a video out on this character super early so I can earn enough money off of ad revenue to buy every Molo plushie. But I still want to provide some valuable content for all of you, so I brought on the Hodon that's worse than plushie panic, Quinny, to give you all some tips. Wait, what's that? Quinny doesn't play Rivals anymore? He plays Martha in Melee? He's also worse than Giga? Well then how am I supposed to make this video- <laughs> What the <laughs> fuck? Play. You do character DSR where you can't play Come on, you yeah, on. still <laughs> oh. oh my god! There's that. <laughs> No, we got it. Touch no, a living thing. Oh wait, wait, we both got it. Wait, two people. Wait, two wait, people got, got it. Oh, 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 sorry. <laughs> sorry. This is <laughs> bullshit. Uh, wow. Did you guys see the Atlas announcement at Evo? That was really cool. I definitely saw that. I honestly can't believe that people thought it was going to be Hodon, seeing as he actually originated on Slingshell for the Atari. 